Uh, well, my name's Joe Wangert. I'm from outside of Philadelphia, uh, and I live in Los Angeles now, which is where I write and perform comedy. That's it. I'm very comfortable talking about my career path so far and my biography as a comedian. <laughs> I started in uh, New York at a place called the Upright Citizens Brigade Theater. And uh, after a couple of years of being in New York, I decided to move to LA, and that's when I really started focusing on doing stand-up. It's weird doing stand-up in LA because there are a lot of shows where it's like, hey, come do, do my show in my garage, or come do my show like in, in my living room, and I'm gonna set up some folding chairs, or there'll be like a show where it's like, you lay in a hammock, and then everyone gathers around you, and then you tell your jokes, and so I did a lot of that sort of stuff for a while and then eventually you get to do regular shows for regular people. I was a teacher, uh, I taught middle school for like five years. In my first year I was teaching eighth graders, so the kids were like as big as me. I had these ridiculous like mutton chops and also I'm me, you know, so I would just be like, hello, I'm your teacher for the year, and they were like, get the fuck out of here, basically. I don't know if I could curse in this thing. Okay, great. I've invented a game, it's called You're Wrapped. Uh, here's the way the game works. You know background actors, right? Well, there's one person in charge of background actors on set, and that person's called the second AD. And they tell all the background actors where to go and what to do, and then when they're done with a background actor, they will dismiss them for the day by walking up to them and going, you're wrapped for the day. And I play this game called You're Wrapped, where I pretend that I'm the second AD of my own life. And all those p people in like the periphery of my life that I see but that I don't want to interact with. I want you to start just silently dismissing those people from your life. So like I'll be at a coffee shop and there will be like a weird old man making a poster for something using colored pencils and I'll just silently go like, you're wrapped for the day. We don't need to see you anymore today. Dog walker with too many dogs and you're getting overwhelmed by the dogs, you're wrapped. Guy at a bus stop that was like dancing really angrily and he had a Hot Pockets t-shirt on, you're wrapped. This guy I saw at a restaurant who kind of looked like Matt Damon, but also very strongly resembled a caveman, you're wrapped. I saw a girl this morning walk in the street and she was just like into her music too much and I was like, nah, -uh, you're wrapped for the day. Black Hulk Hogan, you're wrapped. This was my least favorite question that you emailed me because the question was like, hey, talk, what else is going on in your life besides the tape? Are you getting married? No. Are you getting divorced? No. Having kids? No. New car? Nothing. I got nothing but this. 